The earthquake has left tens of thousands of people homeless in Turkey and Syria, and now those people face the threat of winter and freezing cold temperatures. The need for help is urgent, and Bay Area groups are wasting no time in responding. NBC Bay Area's Marion Favreau is in San Jose, where donations are already coming in. Dianette of Silicon Valley began accepting quake relief supplies here at the San Jose warehouse today, including things like tents. And you can see volunteers are working to get those supplies to Turkey ASAP. People arrive carrying bags of items they hope can help the thousands of quake victims who watch their homes turn to rubble in minutes. While some families are now crowding into the churches that are still standing, others are forced to sleep outside. Think about a camping situation in the winter. Today in San Jose, volunteers with DNet Silicon Valley and the Turkish American Religious Foundation collected and packed up Bay Area donations, but they need more and are asking for specific items. Uh, like blankets and winter clothes, uh, items for babies, uh, like clothing for babies. It could be um, diapers, women's feminine products. They also need over-the-counter medications for flu and cold. Osman Ergenay's family is in Turkey and have told him what they're up against. It's a very chaotic situation. So many, like hundreds of thousands of people are outside. Either their homes are, have collapsed and um, or they're scared to go inside. The structural integrity could have been compromised or they're just scared to go in because there's still aftershocks. This team in San Jose is working quickly because Turkish Airlines is offering to fly the first boxes of supplies from SFO directly to Turkey as soon as tomorrow. The organization is collecting donations at five other sites throughout the Bay Area. We've posted all the addresses on NBCBayArea.com if you'd like to help out. In San Jose, Marianne Favreau, NBC Bay Area News. You can find our continuing coverage of the earthquakes on our website and on our NBC Bay Area app. You can also go to NBCBayArea.com for the latest from the epicenter.